Dean 10. Let's say I develop the knight supporting the pawn. Let's bring the bishop through. As we know, it's to kind of prevent this fried liver thing. Let's just develop the knight attacking the unprotected pawn. But realistically, we don't want to lose tempo in terms of castling. Okay, so losing tempo, grabbing the pawn might be a positive taking, but at the end of the day, for me, if we take here, he's going to push down here anyway. So we could just leave all of them. You know, we don't have to do anything with any of them. But I'm going to take this pawn. Hopefully, I can show why. It's going to get a bit messy because there's going to be tempos lost all over the place. But I'm, ooh, well, I'm not too worried about that one really. But, key thing for me really is, play this, let's attack this knight, if the bishop takes then we get two pieces, but it's not going to take back with the knight. Yeah, so takes, takes, so we grab, he's not going to take back with the knight because he'll be down a minor piece. Oh will he? No, it'll be equal won't it? I don't know what that is. Something's telling me I'm not doing too bad I don't think oh do you know man you take and then this comes down here I don't need to do anything I can just castle and if he's going for the fried liver then so be it in a sense If I take, then he just drops there. So we need to move this bishop out of the way. Let's just move this bishop out of the way. And now we'll move his knight attacking our bishop. So we can push onto the bishop here. He's got his target set. Is the knight winning? Let's push a smaller piece onto a higher piece. Is he squeezing in? That's where bishop's gone. can see their idea oh he don't care oh he's gonna just open up stuff takes bishop takes pawn takes queens in front of the king ah come on oh man it's turned a scrappy mess into something positive well let's just take it anyway so he gets a he'll get a draw because my king's just going backwards and forwards. But I'm not averse to draw, so that's all fine for me. He's not going for the draw. What does that mean then? What does that mean? I'm bringing the bishop here. Hopefully, well, he can still go here, can't he? Just maybe give the queen some space to gain. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not right, is it? If we come here, or if we attack with the queen, this rook comes shooting across. Or if we push this pawn up and then he can't go running across because the bishop will take. Let's push this. There might be more to set to go for it. Just looking at my blind spots because it's a crazy opening that's happened. And I think they have played it well in terms of, you know, putting pressure on the king area type thing. So he's going for a double. So I'm actually going to have to do this and attack the queen. Fingers crossed these two won't get into the game. So probably swinging here, isn't it, with the queen? Yep. And I'm trying to see if there's a back road there. There isn't at the moment. Just bring the king across. I could have just blocked with my queen actually. And then I had the sights of here. This 
attacking the rook, going to attack the queen. Just wondering if he moves back there, then we can just go for a back ranker. But the bishop will take the queen, but I'd rather just go for the back ranker. Gone for the take, want to check on the king. So that means, is, is he going here? Don't forget the bishop can take. It's got the pawn here, so probably going for a check on the king, isn't it? Oh, and it's back ranker. Lovely. Lovely. Only piece that can defend is the queen. Brilliant. 